Uh, people often think I've got an aversion to blocking. Um, uke. The concept of uke or, or receiving, as it's, it's more commonly talked about today, um, it's not a bad thing, but it is a very low grade thing. I want to talk to you about ate instead of uke. Because if I can block a limb, I can also strike the limb. And one of the big features of the system that I belong to and the way we work today is we still have form which still has that ate, still has that striking in it. Um, if I can block a limb, I can destroy it. The reason we came out with uke and uke evolved is that it allows us to train for long periods of time safely without damaging the limbs. But in reality, if somebody throws a limb at me, I'm going to hit whatever comes to me first. I'm going to destroy whatever comes to me first. Because it then makes it easier for me to control my opponent. It also makes it considerably easier when I'm trying to get to that computer, the brain or the head, to take them out completely. Sometimes I might get a lucky shot, I might get straight there. But I've got to deal with these limbs flailing around. Okay, I've got to deal with these limbs trying to hit me as well. So I want to be able to convincingly strike those limbs. So if we look at how we set up Uke, it, it leads very nicely into Ate. So I'm just going to explain. So Alex is going to throw a punch round. You can see me covering here. And you'll recognise that. You'll recognise that position. It's doing the same thing, but I'm deadening the limb. And the same thing is if I'm coming from the outside in. I'm dead in the limb. And the same with Geina, Harate. I'm striking down because I want that position. Agate, I'm striking up into the neck. This, your hands are quite complicated and sophisticated and they move extremely well. And they're used to doing delicate things. If I can strike with a, a bone of a bigger limb, Okay, if I've got a longer striking way, like into the throat, it's far better than using my hand. It's far better using my arm here, striking his limb and deadening the limb. The main difference is I don't stop. I go through. When he punches round, I go through. Because I want to make sure I've got control of the limb. And then I've got my other striking areas that I want to be working with.